Good morning everybody, it is Tony, it is me, it is I, and today I am here because we are going to be doing a Get Ready With Me Holiday Edition. It is officially December, but before we get started, I did want to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by Firmu, and I'm pretty sure that's how you say the name, but they are a glass company that I've worked with in the past. They provided my black glasses that I used to wear back in the day, and you guys can see them there. Yeah. And they were like, we'd love to send you a new pair of glasses. Are you in need of a new pair of glasses? And I was like, 100% yes, totally in need of a new pair of glasses. My old ones were janky, they were old, they were disgusting, and I needed a new pair. So when they emailed me, I went and got my eyes rechecked, and uh, hello, got new glasses. So I went on their website, um, looked around, I really wanted a pink frame, but I didn't know how bright of a pink I wanted. So when I saw this frame right here, which you guys can see, it looks like this, I'm gonna take it off so you guys can see it. It's just a frosted matte pink, like, kind of traditionally frame. Love it. I love this frame so much. I'm gonna throw some pictures of my hair and makeup already done so you guys can see them. But I love my new glasses because they're very, like, I don't know, they're very nostalgic y looking to me. Guys, it is ridiculous how inexpensive their glasses are. And as somebody who's still figuring life out and is in their middle of their 20s, I don't wanna go pay another $180 for a pair of frames and then to have to pay another $170 to get the lens inserted. Like, it can get expensive. If you wear glasses, it can get expensive. So I am very grateful that they provide the glasses super super inexpensive amazing quality and I'm gonna link everything down below like literally specifically this glass because I know a lot of people have DM me on the gram you know you guys know a couple weeks ago I asked you guys what glasses you liked and you guys helped me pick this pair out you know just switch out your frames this is the website for you because you can constantly change your frames out and they will not break the bank so check them out I'm gonna link them down below and um, yeah so with all that said guys let's get started into the makeup video so we're gonna jump right into this video. The first thing that you guys are gonna do is I'm going in with Max soft brown eyeshadow. Any soft, like medium tone brown, I'm gonna throw that in my crease. I don't um, really set my eyes anymore. I just jump into the color. And as you guys can see, I'm also bringing it fairly high up into my like lid because I want my eyes to appear a little bit larger. And by doing this, all I'm doing is really just kind of creating that like high, high, deep set eye, that deep set crease. Make sure you buff it out to your liking. For me, I like to leave a good, you know, buffingness. <laughs> then I'm gonna go in with the Stila palette. We're gonna just dive into two of the shades. We're gonna dive into these two colors. This is from the palette called The Windows Are The Eyes. The Eyes Are The Windows, something like that. It's just a warm brown, which I didn't even realize it was a warm brown until I started literally editing this video. But yeah, just throw that in the crease. We're also gonna go in with like a rich chocolatey brown. This is Max, my favorite, Swiss chocolate. If you do not own Swiss chocolate, girl, it is everything and more, girl. You need her, you need her. And the real technique, guys, it's just about layering. If you're new to makeup, if you're just starting out and you wanna start wearing makeup, honestly, start with lighter shades and layer and layer and layer until you are happy with the colors that you that you have that's how I like to do my makeup I just layer and layer and layer until I'm happy and consistent with what I like because I don't like a smoky eye personally on me I just think it's a little too harsh I like it when it's a little bit softer and now I'm gonna go in with Nillionaire which is a sparkly shadow by color face color face color face <laughs> color pop and I'm just gonna press that on the lid this is like that really pop in shadow that you just want to throw on you're good to go and you can use this with a brush. I personally feel like these Super Shock shadows work amazing with your finger. It's just the way that I like it. I'm also gonna smoke out the bottom lash line. Like I said, guys, I didn't realize how light this makeup looks on camera with all the lights on. In person, it was a little bit darker. I'm also gonna curl my lashes and apply mascara, just because obviously you need to. I'm gonna pop on my lashes off camera. As you guys can see, I'm also using the MAC mascara. I love this one, but I also really do enjoy the Stila one. I just could not find mine. Now for lips, I'm doing um, Jeffree Star's Celebrity Skin, one of my favorite nudes. All right guys, so as you guys can see, this is the completed look. I went in and threw in two packs of hair extensions and I moved into a little sparkly little top that I bought last year for Christmas that I didn't even get to wear, so that's what I'm wearing now. And I just wanted to say, Happy, happy holidays, guys. It's literally December, and there's so much more to come still. Um, 
And yeah, uh, this video is kind of like all over the place, but I hope you guys enjoyed it, getting ready with each other. Let me know what your life is about. What are you guys about to do? It's Christmas. Do you guys even celebrate Christmas? What do you guys celebrate? Let me know down below, and I'll talk to you guys later. Alright guys, the tea on filming a video, like, I didn't have anybody to zip up my <laughs> the back.